All right, everybody, welcome back to Shield Wall. So it's been a while since Shield Wall was updated, and some of you guys may have been wondering, you know, what happened to it? Like, how come you're not playing it? Well, I've been waiting for the new mission, and this is the first mission in Act 2. It's a Roman Civil War, and it's the Siege of Brindisium, where Caesar faces off against Pompey. And I guess just for fun in this video game version of it, oh my god, look at that concept art it's gorgeous basically what happened is uh there's a third party and they're like these roman it's like a roman revolution basically imagine like two people fighting on and then there's this third faction like of like he's led by spartacus in this case and it's like you know it could be a roman gladiator being like hey i want power for myself and so that's essentially what's going on there's gonna be the mexican standoff of three of our teams now we're gonna want to hold charlie here because blue can come in over here via the f route to charlie and then uh, purple, which is Pompey's faction, over here where there's there's actually a fleet of ships. They're going to be coming in from here. So if I can hold Charlie against both these armies, or even have them fight off each other a little bit, that'd be ideal. So we want to take this flag point and hold it to the best of our abilities. We're probably going to have a key battle or two. I'm going to be kind of on patrol. I think I just saw blue. Now is purple. There's Pompey Magnus. Okay, purple is coming in. They're coming in right off the bat. Now, if I could have them fight and clear each other out, ooh, they're doing it. Then I'm gonna take advantage of this, let them fight it out for as long as possible. The, the more they kill each other and the less soldiers I lose, the more gold I'm gonna get. So my first, we, we can upgrade our army. The first upgrade I like to get is the team upgrades, which unlocks a greater number of units or I like also like the standard. I'm thinking, Maybe a standard early would be better. So we're going to kill whoever doesn't win this battle. <laughs> well, I, uh, actually, we, we'll kill whoever does win this battle, won't we? And it looks like pr it's pretty even right now. And then we're going to try to capture one of the flag points real quick. All right, well, they fight. I'm going to see if I can't run out. Dang it, he's already rebuilt his army. Dang. Now, Blue just, Blue just made a beeline for purple. So if they're doing that, then I'm gonna take Blue's flag. That's kind of how you have to play it when there's three. It's like, did you ever play that board game Risk? And you know when like there's three of you, like if you play smart in Risk and you always attack whoever's the strongest, you know, the two weaker ones attack the strongest, then it just keeps going ring around the rosy. And by the way, this one's worth 60. So that's kind of what we're gonna be doing is letting them just duke it out and taking advantage of the anarchy on the battlefield. I should probably, I need to make sure that they don't take Charlie. If they take this flag point, our strategy of defense is pretty much screwed. And I kind of need them both to survive as long as possible. This may not be the best place to fight. Yeah, they're getting reinforcements, so I gotta pull out. I could have lost a considerable amount of my army. We could fight here, but it'd be significantly better if they were to fight each other here. And look at how small Blue's army is. All right, Blue and Purple, fight. There we go, there we go. Okay, good. And I'll call in reinforcements right here. So Blue did manage to beat that little army, so I'm gonna fight both of them off, I guess. And our standard, our standard barrel right there, SPQR, which is Latin for, I guess, the Roman Empire. Ooh, okay, so I think what we want to do is mix a little bit of damage upgrade and then a little bit of gold upgrade as well. All right, so there's Spartacus in his gladiator helmet. You, you, you see that, Spartacus? You're covered in blueberry juice. That's embarrassing. Oh, Charlie's being assaulted right now. Hopefully it's a small army. We'll see. It should be Pompey Magnus, so that should be a full army. No, it's not. Wow, they're really attacking with small armies. I'm not entirely sure why that is. Pompey, you jerk! Rome is mine! Okay, now Jay, I think, is being taken? All right, let's see if we can't stop them from taking this flag point. Because I need to maintain gold superiority. Oh, get out of there, Caesar! A2, Brute! A2? Okay, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so now we gotta figure out our next upgrade. Well, number of units would be the key decision, I think, there. So we can have more soldiers than them. So here's a little bit of history on the Siege of Brundisium. January 10th, 49 BC. Caesar, who was commanding the 13th Legion, crossed the Rubicon River, which in Roman times was illegal. No, no armies were allowed to do that. And essentially was just like, yep, it's civil war time between Caesar and Pompey. 
who I believe was called Pompey Magnus either because he was really awesome and great or he was just fat. Now, Caesar's march on Rome was a triumphal procession. The Senate, not knowing that Caesar possessed only a single legion, they feared the worst and supported Pompey. Pompey declared that Rome could not be defended because Caesar was a big deal. So Pompey escaped to the coastal city of Brundisium, where he was awaiting sea transport for his legions to try to escape across the Adriatic to Epirus, near Macedon and Greece, where Pompey expected his influence to yield money and armies for the war to eventually beat Caesar, maybe on more, more better terms. So Caesar pursued Pompey to Brundisium, trying to hold him in the city, and eventually in March 49 BC, Pompey escaped, fleeing by sea to Epirus, leaving Caesar in complete command of Italy, but with an enemy lying just across the sea. Look at this guy, man. Ha! Spear to your face. All right, so I think the next upgrade we're gonna wanna get is Legionnaires. Or do we wanna do, get some main sign with an aura effect? I like the aura effect idea, but I also want pylum. I want pretty much everything, but legionnaires will make sure that my soldiers are just better than theirs. Whoa, Charlie's being taken. That's not good. Okay, we gotta get over there. Hurry. Dang it, they took it. Purple did, so he's gonna get reinforcements. Dang it, this is, this is not ideal. You can take this flag real quick and then kill them. This is gonna give blue time to regroup. Purple's gonna be able to regroup. This is bad news bears. Because F is being taken by blue. Mm, I'm gonna have to shoot. I don't know what to do. I'm kind of undecided. If Blue's army's small, which it should be. Oh, he's getting a lot of reinforcements, but his gold's low. Oh no, that was a crucial mistake, wasn't it? Hit him while he's down! Dang it, purple just got a windfall of gold. That is huge. But I should be able to get legionnaires now. Yeah, and look at that. They've got chainmail armor. They got better armor considerably. My gold rate is gonna poop. So I think what we should do is buy more gold production. So if you see the GPM, this is supposed to be a 60, but since we've got our bonuses, we're actually getting 75 here. If purple walks in right now, we are not gonna do too well. So we should take advantage and kill that guy right off the bat. Let's throw spears in these guys' tuchuses. That's a spear in your tuchus. <laughs> Dang, dude. I guess what we could do is go for Jay. I think he's over there somewhere. I don't think he's over here. So now it's just whack-a-mole until those two will fight again. Oh yeah, see look, Purple's immediately going over to take what I just took. Every time I take a flag, he'll follow me, he'll follow me, he'll follow me. And I either need Blue to go in and start taking the other guy, or because they're just taking Jay, yeah. This is so obnoxious. Now they're gonna come for this one and I need the gold to build an army because they're gonna go for that one. Watch, you're gonna see. Let's get next to the flag so it takes faster. I need to hire defenders at Charlie. I'm expecting him to pour through those gates soon. Oh, there he is. No! Stop doing that. It's so obnoxious. Where's Blue when you need him? Blue, blue, blue. You're gonna attack me, aren't you? Well, bugger off because nobody likes you. You see, blue will take that purple flag, so essentially I need him alive so that we're both taking pur purple flags. We're gonna capture this one because it's a gold per minute of 60. I guess, hey, purple Pompey, I'm gonna take command of the docks. Yeah, that's what we need is blue to start just messing things up while we rebuild our gold because I can't fight a war of attrition, we would lose. And we'll take this one. This is Pompey's escape route. Hopefully they don't corner us. We need to capture this flag and then run. We cannot be cornered. Blue, look at this. It's like we switched. GPM of 56. Do we have any upgrades? No, we don't. We've been avoiding battle. Basically, you get reward for fighting battles. Oh, purple got killed. Look at him running off with his little two soldiers. Yeah, keep running, dude. I need you to distract blue. I need you both alive. It, it's so stupid. It's so stupid. And I need to retake your gold rate. Oh, wow. Look at how big his army just got immediately. Maybe some of the army survived. That means he's going to be going for that flag now. Dang it. All right. Well, I need more legionnaires and maybe an upgrade. I don't think I need legionnaires. I think I just need cheaper militia because I need to be able to upgrade. Look at that. They came from the docks. It's like... It's like that scene in Lord of the Rings, the uh, Return of the King, where the reinforcements come via the docks, and look at that. Oh my god, why can't you two fight each other? That's that's one of my just main gripes of the game. All right, so then I think what I need to do, like now I'm down to one flag again, where's blue? Blue's just over here, and now I'm gonna go take blue, and if blue and purple never meet and fight, they always just seem to beeline it for me. <laughs> I don't know how I'm supposed to recover this. All right, so they're taking A, so he's in the far side of the map. Blue is just, and he's got one unit here. 
So we'll kill him. What are you doing there, buddy? You moonwalking? I'm actually holding two flags. All right, he's taking B. Yep, and I'm losing J. The fury. Now, at the end of the day, I just need to have more points than the rest of them. So I guess I could kill purple. Now, where do I go from here? I'm taking D. So I guess up that road. It, uh, compass could help. Purple's going to take that one. Now I've got... Purple's always just hunting me down. I guess I guess I am his rival. Is this where the flag is? I feel like purple should be on their way over here. Yes, they are. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna destroy Pompey's army in the field here. Looks like he just fought off a blue army. Now let's get some pylum. And we'll get one barrage. So we gotta wait till they like charge. So that should help us get a little bit of an advantage. And then I they're fighting at my flag point, so I get the reinforcements. Now where is D? Oh my god, it's like right over here. I've got to kill blue, maybe. No, they're... No, we're, we're at D. We're at D right now, okay. Blue's taking Pompey's army. That's what we want. And I... Oh, there's blue. Now, do I have a bigger army? Can I beat them? I know I have a better army, but if he takes this flag... No! Get out of here! Reinforcements! Oh, wow. I've got five experience, one more. I think I need damage to get a... a a different feel on the battlefield going here. Ooh, and we leveled up again. I'm gonna choose gold just because it's. I'm fighting for my life here. I'm fighting for my life! An arm, a uh, body of blues there. I need to hold this triangle. I, I can't even afford reinforcements. Dang it, dude. This is what I've been waiting for for like years, it feels like, is a big battle between those two. Now, I need to sneak up because purple's just gonna keep getting reinforcements, right? And he's got so much gold. He's got so much good, he'll white blue out. He just white blue out. Now he's coming for me. I've only got 93 gold. I don't even have a full army. All right, blue. I'm going to kill purple here, but I need you to do your part. Oh, spear to the face. Wow, are they winning? They're free. They, they won that one. They won that one. Are you kidding me? They won that one. Now blue's over here. I need to lure blue in. Wow, this is bad. <laughs> Uh, I'm literally almost dead. I will respawn. Fight each other! No, I'm dead, but they're fighting each other. I don't even know where flag, what flag I have. D? Dang. Oh my god, I'm bankrupt. I'm bankrupt, and look who's gonna come. Blue. Blue's coming for me. Oh my gosh, how big can I, how big an army can I get? I, it doesn't matter, I've gotta escape, because purple's right there. I'm using the columns as cover. Why are you attacking me? No. This is absurd. This level is absurd. I've got to like juke them out somehow. There's only two guys following me. Ow. Oh, I got him. No way, I'm alive. We may not win this one, but surviving that is impressive to me. So long as blue doesn't march an army in here and crush me. We've got 11 minutes, 11 minutes and change. And purple, no, this is not what I need you to do right now. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm fighting for my life. I mean, purple's got 2,000 points. Oh, look how long it takes me to capture a flag when it's just me. This is bad. I'm literally making no gold. And since I don't have a standard, I'm not boosting my gold. That's what I think you need to do. All right, I need to get out of Dodge. If there's an army anywhere over here. I wish you could buy like a raven and he could like be like the radar for you. <laughs> oh, purple. Purple's calling in reinforcements. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck is this about? That's their general. Is he, is purple out of gold? Oh, there's blue. R get out of there. This is absolutely nuts. Purple does seem to be weak though. He's, he had kind of a small army, but then it seemed like he just rebuilt one. All right, so see how it, it was gold per minute, 45. Now it's zero because no one holds, but once I hold it, it should be higher than 45. It should be 63. Wow. Now, as long as I don't get cornered here and I evade whatever army is going to be coming for me, I don't know what the map composition, what flags I need to hold so that they just keep fighting each other and not me. Because that's ultimately what I want. We've won some key battles earlier, but that's one of the frustrations I have. One of the difficulties. Yeah, they're taking that top flag point right now. So what we're going to do is see whichever way they go and dodge them. And hopefully it's not purple taking it. Don't be purple. It's purple. Look at that. Wait, that's a small army. Oh, he just he just refueled it. Okay, I'm gonna have to hold purple here. I need to kill purple. We do have pylum. So what we're we gonna do here. We got pylums. 
Don't kill all my guys. Oh my god, my guys are losing. My guys are losing badly. I'm gonna have to get out of here. I'm gonna have to get out of here. I'm sorry, guys. I'm broke again. I'm the broke Caesar. Running around with a blood splotch on the back of my head. Oh my gosh. Now, if I get caught between purple and blue, it's over for me, dudes. It is straight up. Oh! Wait a minute, blue! What are you doing? You're not supposed to do that. Oh god. Oh god. Where's the escape route? I think I didn't take the fastest route, so I'm dead. Oh, is purple and blue fighting? Oh, think. Think everything. Purple and blue, finally! Look at look at this. I'm not having a good time, guys. All right, follow me, guys. We gotta take that flag while they're duking it out. Looks like blue's winning. Purple, please don't respawn here. Just don't respawn here. I don't think we're gonna win this one. I've got 800 points, and there's blue. Blue doesn't even have the most points. Purple has the most points. If I just survive, I'm gonna consider that like, <laughs> it's like a stalemate in chess. Uh, but this chess game is like when three people are in the game and you're like, why is there a third person playing chess with me? What is happening? Don't get caught. Don't get caught. I might just want to make a break for it. I think I want to make a break for it. I need to stop purple flags. Where's purple? Where are you, purple? This is gold per minute of 60. He might be taking Bravo. Yeah, blue just took A, so blue's over there. We just need to get all of the purple flags. I just can't hold on to flags. I, I feel like you just have to play boring in this game and like get a lot of uh, hold that triangle early. Purple retook A, so presumably conquering blue. But if they'll let me get this triangle, man, I will make one heck of a Thermopylae. C and D are being taken. Yeah, they're playing Ring Around the Rosie right now. See, they're in the cycle of Ring Around the Rosie. Somehow the AI just glued in on me earlier and we was playing Ring Around the Rosie. I've got 10 men to me name. Basically how I'm kind of keeping an eye on what the AI is doing is in the top middle where the, there's the A through J. If you see swords above them or like on them, yeah, like F is being taken right now. Dang it. Uh, so we don't know who it is yet until they take it. This is not good. I can't fight an open battle. I cannot fight an open battle. It's blue. Wait, that means blue and purple should be right here, right? I just need them to aggro on each other. Nope, he's aggroing to me. We can't have that. Purple's going over there. Now, as long as blue doesn't come this way after taking that flag. Oh, no. I got too cheeky. Well, you know what? Screw this, man. I need to have them all fight. We're going to all fight. That's what we're going to do. Okay? Blue, you're dumb. You shouldn't be in this. It's a civil war between me and Pompey. You're cheating. And nobody likes you. Okay? Nobody likes you, Spartacus. I'm going to get sandwiched, I think. They're in there. Oh, they got Pylum. Oh, great. My guys took the Pylum. Fight each other, you noobs. Yes, it worked. I should, like, my, I need to be able to jump, and my guys need to be able to jump. I wonder what upgrade we need to do, man. There's purple. My arch nemesis, Pompey Magnus Sir Jerkus. Nobody likes him. Everybody hates him. He is stupid. Come on, dude. Come fight. Don't hide behind those Pylums. P -p Pylons. Must construct- Whoa! Yeah, dude, take that, you dirty dog. Purple's over here, and they're not in here. Ah, ha, ha, blue is! One minute left. Yeah, there's just- Purple's- Purple's just on a rampart. I don't know what to do. Maybe you do need to eliminate one of these guys early on. Get out of the way! How did that guy take a spear to the neck? There we go. I may have lost the, the mission here, but I held the line. See, it's like a moral victory. We're gonna take a moral victory here. My shield wall in this Roman city of Brundisium, it, it was terrible. It was terrible. I'm gonna have to come back. Guys, li leave a strategy, an idea of a tactic that we could implement to try to come back and take this one for the good guys next time because it was absolutely brutal. Now, I will say one of the things that I wish the game was a little bit different, right? Um, by having such limited number of units, if you have like three or four teams, it's it can it can sure feel like ring around the rosy and whack-a-mole at times when you're hunting them down or like in that case, like if you get knocked out, there's almost no way out when there's three teams and they both just keep running around, taking all your flags. You take a flag, you run to the next one, they take that. 
it's challenging. So we can at least come back and try to win it if you guys want to see more. So if you guys want to see more Shield Wall, let me know. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.